Hey everybody, happy Thanksgiving! I hope you're out there enjoying your food, um, enjoying your time with your family. My name is Janae and in today's video I'm going to be sharing with you guys things that I do to make myself feel better on days where it's really cold, the sun's not out, it's raining. Uh, this is my, I'm not going to claim that I have seasonal depression because I've never been to a doctor and got diagnosed with that, but whenever I have feelings of sadness and this is how I cope so I hope you guys enjoy I hope you take something from this video and comment down below like subscribe all that good stuff hello everyone today I'm going to be showing you guys how I keep a good mood throughout seasonal depression I mean I'm not gonna claim that I have depression but these are things that I just do to help me stay in a good mood regardless of the weather, regardless of the freaking sun going away at 5 o'clock. Because um, those things are like literally depressing. Like, But I'm just going to be sharing what I do to make myself feel good in a day. So as you guys can see here, I'm just making my bed cleaning my room up, picking it up a little bit. And one thing that I did not mention or show is that I woke up around six o'clock and decided to go ahead and get my day started to not be on social media and to just be with myself with this first hour of my day. Cleaning your room is something so simple, but it'll honestly make you feel 10 times better. Once you walk into a clean room, you're like, dang, I got a whole floor in here. Like, that's crazy. Here is today's breakfast. We are breaking our fast today with some oatmeal. We got some blueberries, bananas, strawberries, and almond flakes. I'll put the link to this recipe in the description. I've never tried it before, but my mom said it's really good and I'm excited. Uh, I just like eating pretty foods that make me feel good. So this right here better be where it's at. And as I eat my food, I'm gonna watch as Leah's new video um I really be feeling like all the youtubers is my friends but in reality they don't know me and I just know what they post on freaking social media on freaking YouTube but it's her last video in North Carolina it's the one where it's the 20 20 year old the 20 transformation she turned 20 and did a transformation but uh yeah so I'm gonna eat this oatmeal as I watch that video just to relax and enjoy, you know what I'm saying? And look at that, the first video to pop up. Ha ha ha. Mm -hmm. This oatmeal is very refreshing. Like, it's not too sweet. It's not like, like the oatmeal that I usually eat is like hecka peanut butter, hecka um, non-dairy chocolate chips. Like, that's the oatmeal that I eat religiously. This right here is really refreshing. Alright guys, so we're on the way to uh, the car wash dealer. Car No, not the dealer, but the car wash. Because if you know, if you don't know, now you know. I put I be putting wood in my back seat. Because I made a little, um, what do you call it thing? A platform. So I'm gonna go clean the back in the trunk. Like if I could show you, I got you hooked up, hold on. Like it's dirty down there cause the wood. So I'm about to go clean it and get some daylight. Look at the sun, not look at the sun, but you know what I mean. Just get some sun in and appreciate it because I know that it gets dark early. So 
just gotta do stuff early in the morning. It is currently 9.05 and my breakfast was amazing. I didn't finish watching as Leah's video, but I'm pretty sure I'll get back to it. But. Okay guys, so I finished vacuuming. Hold on, let me give you some real good angles. Yes, queen, slay queen. Oh, why it look a little dirty right here? I'm gonna have to give her a little lights all white, but you slay queen, slay Lola, she's looking. She's looking very good, just like her mama. Mm, yes, ma'am. Uh, I'm gonna go into Goodwill because it's literally right next door. And I'm gonna wash my hands because there was some like gunk i think it's from the hand sanitizer because let me show you it looks like this you see what i'm saying so i'm gonna just go wash my hands and look around in the goodwill see what they got i'm not trying to spend a lot of money so i probably won't buy anything unless i see something and i'm like but that's about it so i'm gonna go in the goodwill because goodwill makes me happy and i'm right here why not okay and y'all, so when I first got in the car, I pressed play and I was listening to Erica Badu, but Erica Badu didn't start playing. It was Slide by Quilla Ray and I haven't heard the song in so long. So I was jamming. Then um, when I finished vacuuming the car, I pressed play again on the music and now it's One Night Only by Brent Fias. And I haven't listened to Brent in so long either. So I'm just in a like, it's really just giving it's really giving like listen to some music you haven't listened to in a while and watch it just change your mood i'm i'm telling you i'm telling you so this backpack it was giving hiking backpack and i was kind of feeling it but that stain on the top and then it was five dollars and i was like eh, nah and these cowboy boots right here they remind me of Alyssa vanilla if you guys don't know her you can look her up on youtube she's real cool i love her then these last boots i was kind of confused because were they snow boots like i was like omg like these are cool they were five dollars okay y'all so i'm out of the goodwill let me put some hand sanitizer on i gotta put y'all down real quick sorry but I'm out of the goodwill. Um, I'm gonna go to another thrift store in my area because they sent me a text message saying they had 50% off the whole entire store. And last time, like a few times ago, I went there and they had this really nice backpack and I didn't buy it. And then the next time I went in, they didn't have it no more. And I'm pretty sure I watched this lady pick it up. I think that's exactly what it was because I've been in, I go in there every time they text me that they got 50% off, I'd be in there. So I'm pretty sure I watched this lady pick it up and I was so hurt. I was so hurt. But it is what it is. That means it won't for me. Um I found these y'all, I found these dope behind snow boots. Um catch me in god dang Alaska, okay? Cause what? I, I don't think I could ever be in Alaska for real. Cause don't they have like 12 months? No girls 12 months in a year bro they have six months of light and six months of darkness like i could not do that like i'm over here struggling because it turns dark at five o'clock for it to be dark for six months straight i'm gonna need somebody from alaska to give me a mental health check-in how are you doing how are you i know it's rough how are you getting through please let me know because i feel for you i i just Yes.
So y'all, here is lunch. I came home after the thrift store. Um, my mom bought this from I think Publix. And yeah, it's just something slight. It's got the noodles, sesame seeds, sesame garlic sauce, and then some vegetables. This is what it's looking like. I haven't put any of the sauce and stuff in there because the ingredients, I mean the instructions say to put it in after. But this is gonna be our lunch today. Yesterday, I definitely did not eat enough food and I was not feeling good. And I had to eat some meat yesterday because I was just like, we didn't have nothing cooked. We didn't have, like, I just was so over it. I was like, bro, I'm hungry right now. I can't, like, and you know, I was expecting me to feel like the meat, like the meat tasted weird, but it didn't. It just tasted like what it usually tasted like whenever I used to eat meat on the regular, but um, it wasn't even that I needed protein. I think because being vegan, vegetarian, all that stuff, you don't get your omega threes and B12 and whatever. It's a couple of vitamins that plant-based foods don't like. If you're not eating specific plant-based foods, you're not going to get enough of that vitamin. And I think that I'm not getting enough vitamin A which is the omega-3, I think it's called like ALA or something like that. So, and chia seeds have that in them, so I'm gonna put this on my stir fry. I really don't even care. I need these vitamins, and I wanna make sure that I'm getting them, because I kinda, I wanna get all my nutrients without having to take supplements. 111 on the thingy, but you can't see it. Um, if I could get this bag open. Alrighty guys, here's my food. I'm gonna finish watching as Leah's video. All right, y'all, we finna go to the second thrift store, the one that is 50% off today. And we finna see what we gonna, what we gonna find. We gonna see what we gonna see. And that's that. Get dum dum diddy. Okay. Y'all, so one of my favorite things to do when it's bright outside, I dropped my water bottle. When it's bright outside, I love to go outside and sit in the sun and read because you need your vitamin D and I like to just feel the sun on my face and you know, that's really about it. Y'all, so the sun ain't playing no games. My freaking legs are on fire. I'm gonna take these pants off and put some different pants on and come back out here and get some different shoes. I'm gonna just put some white pants on or something and chill out here and read. Y'all, I don't know what the freak is up with me in this nutrition and the vitamins because I ate that stuff that I showed you guys, right? I was outside reading, then I came inside because I don't know why I came inside. I left the book outside, the chair, everything. Um, my mom, she went to the store. I asked her to get some hummus and I just cut up a pepper because I'm still hungry, basically. And so I'm eating a pepper with hummus. I'm about to watch some TV or something. I'll probably go get my book and read that. But for right now, I'm just eating this hummus and this pepper. I usually, I like used to not like hummus. And I mean, this is not my favorite. But I know that hummus is made out of chickpeas. And I know that if I don't want to die, I need to make sure I'm getting some vitamins. I don't even know. I'm going to look up like what vitamins do red peppers give you and hummus and all that guys no cap i think i just found my cheat code because loki i do kind of feel a little better i do kind of feel a little better and i just looked up what vitamins do red peppers give you and vitamin a and vitamin c and what what vitamins do hummus give you they get hummus gives vitamin b iron 
and some other stuff. But it would probably be way more healthy if I made the hummus myself. I got a carrot. Carrots and hummus is going to be my new thing, bro. I'm, I'm telling you. And make sure you guys are drinking your water. And I just want to say, usually I, I'll sit outside for hours, like, in the sun. And, like, I, of course, I'll wear, like, long sleeve shirt because it's getting colder outside. But for me, I live in Florida, you know, I have the option to go outside and get that vitamin D. But for other people, for you, I'm not sure like where you live or if it's like really cold. The only place that I can think is like really cold in my head right now is like New York. I don't know why. But like, and honestly, there's like so many people in New York. I don't even know how your living situation is. Like, do you live in an apartment? Does your apartment have a balcony or you know what I'm saying? Like, I don't, I don't know. So like for me, or maybe you can go to a park. Um... I don't know, I like to do yoga outside or just sit outside in general so I can get in that vitamin D and I'm not just in the four walls of my room all day, you know what I'm saying? Currently I'm in my room, but that was because I was I was feeling hungry and I, I wasn't feeling too good. So I, I wanted to make sure that I ate something and I'm feeling a lot better after I'm eating my carrot with my hummus. And I'll probably go back outside. If not, I'll probably start cooking because tomorrow's Thanksgiving. And I wish you guys a happy Thanksgiving because this video is coming out tomorrow. So guys, I'm try I was trying to read this book on t Tantra, The Path to Ex Ecstasy. I believe that it's a breathing technique. I believe. I honestly don't know. But it's just a little bit too much for me right now maybe spirit is telling me this isn't the book for me in this current moment of time right now i just no i can't do this i literally only got three pages in and i literally keep looking at my phone every like five seconds so i'm gonna go pee and get my little vegan book because that book was pretty good and i was reading it real fast and i could finish that book real quick and then start on a stock book something that's gonna get me to this money baby oh girl.